Hello everyone, it is me. I can't do my signature today because I have my hands full. And you can probably see her in the corner. We have a new little member. And this is Sammy. Hers don't like to be held right now. Her still trying to get used to people. But this is Sam Sam, our little new little baby. And say hi Sam Sam. Say hi. This is Buggy's new pet. He got her for her birthday. So, for my mom. So, here's our new little cute little member. She's really cute. She's a big girl, though. Mm, and she, and she, yeah. I'm still trying to get used to me. Well, I guess someone who had her didn't hold her enough when she was a baby. But we're still trying to get her used to everybody. But just thought y'all would like to see our new little baby. Yeah, don't bite. First thing she could bite. She hasn't bit me yet, but I still don't want her to bite me. But for today, we are having our new games today. So let's see who's today is. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I had to put little little girl up. She's not really wanting people to hold her right now. No, we're talking about last time. Last time on Emily, for some reason, my camera messed up, like, right at the end, and I don't know why. But, I think it's because I can't see it, like, when I can't have Amber's. But, we're still gonna try, I'm still gonna try to work with it. If not, then I'm gonna find something, I guess, just keep working on it. Am I the good the recorder? I'm not really sure right now, but I'm still working on it. So that's why I've been trying to hold her to get her used to being held. But she still runs around the cage when I go to grab her. And I don't know how to get her used to me. So if anyone has a guinea pig, can you give me some advice or some tips or something of how to get her like used to me to the point where she won't try to bite me? <laughs> but besides that, let's get started. Not my thing. I mean, I'd take it otherwise. I can see right through you, Kyle. I know what this is really about. It's not about you, Karen. Us? It's about us. There is no us. You've made that clear. I don't want to take the new the new job offer. I'm comfortable here. I like it. The money and the hours are better. You would have taken it in a heartbeat back when we were together. Exactly. If I were making this decision for us, I'd take it. You're only staying here for me. Just a minute. Oh, 
really sorry about the other day with Emily's. I don't know why that messed up, but it did, and I don't know why. I really don't. Like, I tried to fix it and everything, but there is no way of me fixing it. I thought it was my editor, but it wasn't, and then when I seen it in the camera place, it kind of upset me, because I want to make sure my content is good for y'all. Thank you. 
believe I'm finally a flight attendant. Mom, are you okay? I'm lucky to be here. I knew it was tough for you. Yeah, the whole time zone thing is definitely a downside to the lifestyle. I love you too, Mom. Hey! Another whiskey. Sir, the call button's only meant to be used mid-flight, not during takeoff and landing. Do you have an idea how much I paid for this ticket, young lady? I'm sorry, sir, but you've only just taken off. You can have to wait. In. You will have to wait until the captain. More than your annual salary, I bet. So if I want another drink. That's enough. Regulations are for your safety, sir. And they're, they're not neglectable. Excuse me? Who do you think? Sir, I will bring you a drink as soon as the seatbelt light goes off, and not a second before. Is that how you think we should treat customers, Miss Hope? Every customer is different. If they're rude and they're annoying, ignoring the rules, we need to be firm. This is a difficult job. Not everyone has the skill set to do it. You need to learn track and self-control. I think she did what she thought was best. I would have done the same thing. Trust me, I've had customers just like that, and I do the same thing they do. But, <laughs> I guess in her eyes, it's not Oh! 
the top. You did the right thing. Karen should see that. She hates me. I just don't get it. 
You know, we should ask Hank his opinion. He's pretty good at dealing with these, with stuff like this. Okay. Uh oh, Karen's already talking. To you worry too much, Karen. Amber's great for this job. She's failed the exam. Plus, she has no former training. We should hire another candidate. Not so fast. You need to give her a real chance. It's only been a few weeks. What if we crash land on water? She couldn't even jump into the pool. It's highly unlikely. Crash landings are rare. Cars may be dangerous. Death traps, but planes rarely have to ditch. You know that. That's not the point. This job is about handling emergencies, and the tests are in place for a reason. And you know about her past. Sometimes I wonder if you just hired her out of pity. That's enough, Karen. Pity never helped anyone, and it plays no part in my decisions. I know, I'm sorry, it's just with her past. This conversation is over, Karen. My decision is final. Amber stays for now. God. Amber kills me. I mean, Karen kills me. Always be mean to Amber for no freaking reason. Amber does her job right. Karen's just evil. She's a bitch, put it that way. I hate to say that, but she is making Portland. And she doesn't, she's so upset, she doesn't even want to play her drums. I'm hopeless, Sushi. They're going to fire me. I know it. Even you'd be better at my job than me. At least you can swim. You okay, Amber? You're looking a little blue. It's just the uniform. Nice try. You can't fool a mother, you know. Try again. It's just... I really don't think I'm cut out for this job. I don't deserve it. That's not true at all. You're great at this. I always knew you would be. But I failed my test, and Karen thinks I'm unqualified. People like Karen sometimes mistake tests for real life, but a test is just one way of measuring something. You ain't, we ain't machines. We're more complicated than that. You have character and passion. Is that really enough? I'm not so sure anymore. What's, what matters most is your willingness to learn. I mean, I've made tons of mistakes. Oh yeah? Like what? One time I accidentally left a meal in the oven and the whole plane smelled like burnt bread of cheese. And that's just one of the mistakes among hundreds. It's all just part of being a person. She's still taking those? Oh, I thought she quit taking those after we told her not to. She says not to turn out. I can't turn out. Stop.
medium. These are really biggy, so I'm not gonna eat them. Then the next time he asks for it, he's like, nope. So he's like a hard kid to learn what. What? I said her. This one in front.
hot dates coming up. What about that cute doctor? Saving a life together is pretty good. Start to tell your kids. Speaking of, hey Amber, flying on your airline tomorrow. Hopefully I'll see you there. Well, speak of the devil. Which good looking man is that from? You can show off your beautiful flight attendant badge to him. If Karen lets me keep it. There you go. You, we believe in you, Amber. You should take... That's why I'm going to stop today. We just do three. We'll finish up that one. And we'll see... Let's we'll see what comes up tomorrow. Sorry, little man's trying to bring his tablet in here. And you're probably hearing it. Oh, I'm trying not to... Let y'all hear that <laughs> over me. It's wildfire. But go take your tablet back in there now. Now, one, two, then go. But yeah, don't know what Karen still is with Amber. Don't know why she don't think we can't do it, but we're gonna show her whether or not she likes it. But we'll finish it. Well, uh, tomorrow's Emily's. Let's hopefully my camera don't mess up again tomorrow. I'll keep working on it. Let's see where it goes from there. But hopefully y'all enjoying this little series we got going. Hopefully we're almost at the end and uh we can go on to Seven Wonders is the next one I'm going to do right after this one. And the new Emily's game, I'm probably going to start with her next one, I think is Emily's Love Life or something like that. We're going to start on that. But hopefully, y'all, if y'all do, give this a like and comment down below. If you have any advice for me about my new little guinea pig, please let me know. It would be really appreciated if you would and everything. But... I'll see y'all in the next video. Much love, my angels.